just as all these different types of waves that we've talked about are disturbances of some medium, a light wave is also a disturbance. And a light wave is a disturbance in an electromagnetic field. And I'll tell you what I mean by that. Imagine some charged particle sitting here. Well, we can imagine an electric field around this charged particle and we'll draw it by drawing these field lines. Now if you were to grab this particle and shake it back and forth, then that could cause a disturbance in these field lines. And just, just like taking a piece of rope and grabbing the end and shaking it back and forth will cause a wave to travel along that rope. You can imagine shaking this particle back and forth and causing waves in the electromagnetic field. And those waves traveling, those are light waves. That's what a light wave is. It's a disturbance in the electromagnetic field. And you can think of the charge as producing the electric field and then when you shake it, when you move it, that causes the magnetic field. And when you're shaking it back and forth, you're causing a disturbance in both the electric and the magnetic field. And the electric and magnetic fields go together in this case because you have a charge that's moving. And the charge is producing an electric field and the motion of the charge is producing a magnetic field. So they come together and they both, this, this vibration that you get from shaking the charge travels through this electric and magnetic field. And the physicists think of it as simply an electromagnetic field. And that disturbance in the electromagnetic field is a light wave. And just like we saw that sound waves can exist at different frequencies, and different frequencies of sound waves correspond to different notes that you hear, light waves can ex exist at different frequencies too. You could shake this charge back and forth rather slowly, only a few times per second, or many, many thousands of times per second. And the different frequencies of light waves correspond to different colors. And all the light that we see is exactly that, is a disturbance of the electromagnetic field. And radio waves and microwaves and x-rays and all the other types of radiation are also light waves. They're all disturbances in the electromagnetic field. And because the electromagnetic field permeates space, light can travel through empty space. And light always moves through empty space at a, at a certain speed, 3 times 10 to the 8th meters per second. That's 300 million meters per second. That's the speed of light. That's an important number uh, and a well-known constant. It's constant all through the universe. That's how fast light goes every single time.